cost 400 bucks. Hopefully it uh, goes to the right line this time. Fan fest was canceled. All right, are you ready for the craziness? Yeah, my last like four minutes of sameness. Yep, here we go. All right, it's 3.30, we're on the way to the airport. We leave at 6 a.m. from Phoenix. And then we go to LAX. I don't know what lane I'm in. I can't see it. Okay. That's terrifying. <laughs> It's 3.30 in the morning, raining in Arizona, <laughs> you're like, I'm tired and I can't see anything. And we have like a three hour, 45 minute layover at LAX to go to the lounge, get some breakfast. What lounge? Delta Lounge. How many points are you getting for the trip abroad? Probably a fair amount. And we land at three and then we drop off our bags going straight to a fan fest and you're going to surprise everybody on stage. All right, we finished the hard part. We checked all the bags. Trevor's, uh, where are you going? Okay, he has no idea where he's going. Um, Trevor's force plates were seven pounds over the 70 pound weight limit so it costs 400 bucks so that, so that sucks but we got three free bags up to 70 at least shout out to delta all right the clear guy wished uh trevor good luck in japan so he uh he knew what we were here for and now just waiting for this loser to get through security because he refuses to get pre-checked Alright, so you slept on the flight? Yeah, I got like 40 minutes of sleep or whatever. You got zero. Okay, so I have about an hour left um, before we board, so I'm going to shower and get ready for bed so that I can sleep on this long flight. Now that we're in the air, what are you most excited for uh, when we land? Um, well, I'm excited to see all the Japanese fans, like, loving you and a fan fest tonight because I just think it's going to be cool. It's been a long two years, so I'm excited for that. Um, I'm also excited for both of <laughs> How are you planning on getting your coffee when you're in Japan? <laughs> There's Starbucks, and I'm gonna find new coffee places. Are you though? Yeah. What'd you get? I got some uh, salmon, rice, fruit. You did the Japanese style, right? Yeah. Love it. All right, are you ready for the craziness? Yeah, my last like four minutes of. The sameness. Yep, here we go. All right, I lost him because I think he has to go to the like resident visa side. So, whoops, just gonna get our bag while this guy tries to get through his custom. So, just try to do it on my own and hopefully uh, he goes to the right line this time. And we still gotta get the force plate. All right, all of them and then Force plate right down there. Right there. I'm in the in the cab on the passenger side, which is the driver's side, which I did not realize that Japan does that. But fan fest was canceled because of the weather, so it's gonna rain. So we're gonna go relax in the hotel.
All right, so we just got settled into his apartment, um, which is like this cool, cool little spot with some cool views of the city. One unique thing about um, playing in Japan versus in the United States is that the team actually takes care of your housing for you, um, which again, just very different than, than the, the United States. So also made it a lot easier, obviously, making the transition and coming here for him this year, um, just kind of having everything set up, taken care of, um, yeah, makes it makes it a lot so easier. it's been a long couple days blended together. Time to get some much needed sleep. Had a great dinner with the guys. Tried a lot of um, interesting different meats. Um, had tongue, which I think was the first time I've had that. They made us try it before telling us what it was, but just very like rubbery. Anyway, it's gonna get some sleep. And then tomorrow at 10 a.m. we have the to be downstairs for to go to the press conference. And then straight from there, the facility, long other day. So for now, good night.